So we can go ahead and put my iPhone in there and clips very nicely into Paylace. Hey Wear Noticers, Shane here and welcome to another video on the Wear Notice Technology YouTube channel. If you're new here, definitely take a moment to consider subscribing so you don't miss out on all my other awesome technology videos about things like smartphones, smartwatches, tech accessories, cases, computers, tablets, and really just so much more. But anyway, folks, in this video, we're gonna be unboxing this guy right here. This is Otterbox's MagSafe Folio for none other than my iPhone 14 Pro Max. But before I start taking this out of the box, I do have to give a huge thank you to Otterbox for sending me this folio out for free in order to make this video about it. So thank you very much, Otterbox. But anyway, let's start getting this guy out of the box. Here we go. So folks, here we are up close and personal with this box. As you can see, it says Otterbox Folio. It is for the iPhone 2022 Extra Large Pro otherwise known as the iPhone 14 Pro Max, and it is a MagSafe folio as well. Over here on the back, let's see what else it talks about. It says you can hold your card in cash. It says it's reliable and a credit card safe magnet, and it's for use with a MagSafe case. So anyway, I'm just super curious to see what this is like, because as you guys know, I love MagSafe accessories, first of all, but I've never actually tried out a MagSafe folio. Usually, you know, I've used MagSafe wallets, right? Phone wallets, but never a whole folio. So this is pretty exciting. We got some paperwork here. We've got the actual folio itself right here. We can pull this out if it lets me pull it out. It seems like it's pretty in there. Okay, we got some cardboard right there, cardboard inside of it as well. And here is what it looks like. So let me grab my iPhone right here. And first, let's try it out without a case. So as you can see, we got the MagSafe ring right there of magnets. We can pop this on and wow. This is interesting, look at this. So yeah, without a case on, it does feel kind of naked in my phone. I probably should put a case on, but it's good to see what it looks like without it. If you wanna explore that option, basically you can see the deep purple of my beautiful 14 Pro Max right here. You can see the Otterbox logo right here on the back of the folio. And we've also got this nice little clip, this magnetic clip to hold the screen cover shut on the phone. So yeah, obviously, you know, I think with a case too, this would probably move around a bit less because as you can see it's got a lot of room right here um, and it's probably just not thick enough without a case on so it does move around quite a bit without it just something to note in here we've got those slots as well for your cards and then in here we've got some room for cash so this actually has quite a bit of room i think that's pretty cool and i see some volume buttons right here so i bet you can control the volume uh because it looks like those are right there even with this closed so that's kind of cool so without a case on you know i can still do it i'm pressing the volume buttons um, but again, there is like definitely a, a bit of room between the buttons themselves and this folio. So, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and actually I'll put an Otterbox case on. I've got this Otterbox symmetry right here that they also sent me for free. Already made a video about that, so be sure to check it out if you haven't. And let's pop the folio off and let's pop my iPhone into the symmetry. And the symmetry right here, of course, does have MagSafe magnets built right into it. So we can go ahead and put my iPhone in there and clips very nicely into Paylace. And oh yeah, see, this is a much better fit with the symmetry. Now, as you can see, the screen cover isn't moving around a ton. The volume buttons right here are actually lined up with the volume buttons. So yeah, this is nice. Definitely use this with like a symmetry case or something similar to that because this is just a cool combo. And as you can see, I got the um, folio here in blue. So it definitely stands out against the case, but I think that's kind of interesting. That way you can really remember that it is a MagSafe accessory right here. It's not part of the case, which I think is actually pretty cool because maybe sometimes you'll want the folio if you're going and you need to bring like all your cards with you but if you really don't if you're just going to like pay with apple pay that way you can easily take the folio off use the same case and just not worry about it, instead of having to constantly switch cases so i think this is actually a really really cool accessory right here because like also folks with a typical folio when you're trying to use your phone itself you have to deal with the screen cover on the back right here you know taking up a bunch of room and making your phone feel thicker and bulkier but with this like if you don't if you're not directly using the folio and having your phone covered, you can easily just rip it off, right? And then just use your phone in its nice slim case instead of having to deal with this big bulky thing if you don't want to. So again, I think this is like a really genius and super cool accessory right here. The only thing I will say though is these card slots right here, they do feel kind of cheap. Like this material feels 
quite thin like paper, so I'm wondering how durable it is. But I mean, overall, I think the accessory besides these parts right here feels super solid, like the outside of it. And I really love this satisfying, you know, magnetic clasp right here. I mean, listen to that. That's just kind of fun to play with. And I mean, one more benefit of having this Folio MagSafe style that I just thought of is like with a normal Folio, right? You're bending it backwards like this when you're using your phone screen. But then like, how do you take a picture, right? Because look, your rear cameras are blocked. You'd have to like dangle it or something like this. But again, with this type of case, you can just boom, rip off the MagSafe folio, take your pictures, and then when you're done, put it right back on and you don't have to worry about it. So I think, once again, this is a really cool accessory. But anyway, folks, with that, there's not really much more to say about this OtterBox MagSafe Folio for the iPhone 14 Pro Max. If you guys want it for yourself, it will set you back about $50. So definitely let me know down in the comments what you guys think of this folio. Do you love it for yourselves? Do you love it? Do you hate it? You should definitely let me know because I do read all the comments, by the way. And if you're interested for a case for your iPhone 14 Pro Max, definitely be sure to check out my playlist of all the different iPhone 14 Pro Max cases that I've unboxed. I'll have a link to that down in the description, so be sure to check that out. Also, if you enjoyed this video, definitely be sure to smash that subscribe button and subscribe to the Wear Notice Technology YouTube channel for more awesome technology videos just like this one. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and thank you so much for subscribing. Bye.